Hey everybody, welcome back to my Pokemon Yellow Let's Play. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go into this house and talk to Daisy. This is Gary's older sister, and she, despite what Gary said, is going to give us the town map. We are now going to venture up back to Viridian. There is a song to play in your head while you play that for Pokemon fan nerds like myself. I uh, already got the free potion from the sky, I just forgot. We are now going, just strolling through the grass. I'm babbling on now because I don't know what to talk about, and I just need to keep my mic picking up my voice, and so I'm just babbling on. I know I can play a lot about garbage. We are going to go, and now we're going to go into the Pokemart because we need some supplies. We need some drugs, dude. Uh, but first, we are going to catch or get some Pokeballs because we are very soon going to catch a Pokemon. We're gonna get some potions right here, and also because we're going to venture into the Viridian Forest, we are going to get some antidotes. Now, I mentioned that we're going to catch uh, our first Pokemon here, so I was thinking. Something, let's do something outside of the box. Everyone goes with a very specific Pokemon when playing yellow, uh, which can be found in this little patch of grass right here. Most people go for this Pokemon right here, Mankey, and there's nothing wrong with it. First gym leader is a rock gym leader, so fighting does great against it. But I thought let's do something different, and I'm actually just going to cut ahead until I find it. Kind of rare. Be right back. And there it is! We are going to catch ourselves a Nidoran male. Now there's actually two different kinds of Nidoran, the male and the female. Uh, the male, which is the one I'm catching right here, is a lot more physical attack based and a little bit faster, while opposed to Nidoran female, which when fully evolves like Nidoran male. Uh, Nidoran female is a lot more defensive and special attack and special, and we catch it on our first try, so that's pretty cool. And yeah, added to our Pokedex. This is our first cat. I'm pretty happy about it. And what do I want to nickname it? I thought, what is... Because Nidoking's final evolved form is called Nido King. So I thought, what is better than a king? Well, there's only one thing better than a king, and that is a boss. So I decided to call him Nido Boss. And we are actually going to quickly go back and heal. And also, what I'm going, I'm planning on doing right now is I'm going to do a little bit of grinding because both my Pokemon are very under leveled compared to where I want them to be. Well, let's first pick out our Needle Boss. Pretty good stats. Okay attack, or okay attack. But we are going to do a little bit of grinding right here. So I'm going to cut to yeah, I'm just going to cut it to where I want to be, and I will see you guys later. We're back after a little bit of grinding. I'm gonna show off my Pokemon right here. Boss is now level eight. Learn Horn Attack. Sparky is now level nine. Either way. And I was actually not thinking right here, but we are going to go into a battle that I know of that's fairly important. The Pokemon Yellow version. That's why I'm gonna switch to Pikachu first. battle is right up here, I'll skip over random encounters, but yes, battle right here is against Gary. Now, this battle is more important in yellow than it is in red and blue version, because this helps determine, depending on, because there's three or four battles you will fight with Gary, all of which you will still have an Eevee, but on the final battle, this the combination of battles determines what he evolves his be into. Level 9, and I'm just going to destroy it, and I get which is nice, which is pretty nice to have. So even though he lowers, even though he lowers my from a special attacker anyway, Thunder Shock just totally destroys it, and he goes down. And now he's going. Now he's going to send out his Eevee, and I'm going to switch to Needle Boss, so that Needle Boss can get experience because he needs all the experience he can get. This is Needle Boss's deciding battle, and I'm going to Horn Attack. 
and it does moderately okay damage. Use a sand attack, which is nice that it misses because sand attack is annoying. Hot failed. So I was actually thinking what I should do, and I decided to go with Leer because I wanted to at least three hit KO it, and it lowers my defense too, which kind of sucks. But I go in for a horn attack now, and even hit sand attack, which is kind of really annoying. So I horn attack right here, do moderately good damage. Tackle does pretty good damage, but that is a critical hit. I miss right here, so that peeved me. Sand attacks again, which is annoying. And I miss again with my horn attack, so that got really annoying. But I horn attack again, ALMOST TAKE IT OUT! Which is uh, Which it now needs to die by my very furious horn attack. I got a little riled up there, I think that will make my commentary more exciting. And Needle Boss grows to level 9, which always makes my day, because Needle Boss needs to get to level 12. Because at level 12, he will learn the attack of the reason why I him in the first place. So he's gonna complain and call us they waddling around and so uh, all that did not do fully. So what I think I'm gonna do here oh first drop my Pikachu and it likes me. Ah oh, that made my day. I put a smile on my face and a bean burrito in my heart. I am hungry. So we are actually going to go quickly heal up, and then we are going to continue on our little adventure. Be right back. And we're back! Yay for the healing. So I thought actually when I was playing this that I ran up, that I didn't go and buy supplies. And then I checked like, oh, to make sure, and I'm like, oh yeah, I do have plenty of supplies. So I'm like, oh, I came in here for nothing. I don't need more drugs. Time to quit. Be a better person. Yeah. So we're going to go up here, and there's this old man. If you tried to come up here before, you gave Professor Hope his drugs. Uh, he will block your path, saying it's a stomachache, and the girl right there will say, "Oh, you know, my grandpa's sick." But he's going to show us how to catch a Pokemon, because apparently we don't know how to catch a Pokemon, even though we have two Pokemon in our party. We like try to be like Professor Oak and catch it without hurting it or doing anything with one Pokeball, and he misses. So unfortunately, he is not a boss like this. Unfortunate for him, but that's not our problem. And he leaves, and we're just gonna go right on ahead. So because I'm getting close to the ending of this video, I am going to cut it right up here when I move up here. And the next little step to our video is we're gonna go through Verdian Forest right up here, and I will see you guys then. Bye.